All right, hello and welcome back to another live stream. We're trying out, starting out today with Pyre of Heroes Dino. Hopefully, that's going to be pretty good. I'm pretty excited. Haven't done a whole lot with it, so these few matches, maybe more than a few, that we try out here should be pretty good. Pretty good. Just give a brief overview, rundown of the list. Switch up that view there. We've got, of course, Pyre of Heroes going to help us break a Marauding Raptor board lock. If it ever gets to that, we get two Marauding Raptors out. We do have something at three to sacrifice maybe Drover, Huntmaster, although they are human, so we probably don't want to do that. But Marauding Raptor, we got something at three, something at four, five. Then Carnage Tyrant at six, maybe we want to sacrifice the Regisaur Alpha, possibly. Now I may have to tweak the creatures just to have a nice even spread and get the most possible potential use out of Pyre of Heroes. But for now, we'll keep it as is, maybe tweak along the way right here. Sideboard switched it up a fair bit. We've got Inscription of Abundance for some nice instant speed interaction. Masked Vandal for our artifact enchantment removal. Portable Hole, uh, the Witch's Oven for the cat, that sort of thing. Shifting Ceratops, as always, fantastic. And then Anger of the Gods, you've seen me use it, probably used it yourself, possibly. So yeah, pretty standard, pretty basic, pretty usual, mostly, to what I like to use. So we'll get right into it. Maybe break into Diamond here. Might be pretty good. Hopefully no Azorius control. It was pretty rough. Took a game from him from them uh, previous match just before I started here. Yeah, that uh, hull breach, hull breaker horror, that can be pretty bad if they get that down. It's basically over, I think, unfortunately. That's been a headache for me. But if we can get shifting ceratops, uh, it should work out pretty good. Definitely like the looks of this. I think I'll still go turn one commune and See if we can get a nice play. Oh, beautiful. Rampaging Frostodon. Going in blind just in case they are some sort of life gain. It's nice having Rampaging locked in for turn three. Well, it doesn't look like life gain, but we got the Rampaging. And they don't have any instant speed removal at one black to kill the Drover. Shouldn't. So that's nice. Hmm, interesting. Well, we'll go Shelter Thicket just because we can. I'm still able to play the Rampaging. Maybe could have just played the other route bound, swung with the Drover, but Shelter Thicket has to come down tapped at some point, so might as well get that out of the way. Hmm. Oh well, Commune, get us something good. Ooh, Marauding Raptor. Yeah, I like the looks of Marauding. Hopefully they don't have any removal for our stuff, but uh, it's looking likely being in black there. If all goes well, we get Galta next turn. Not hasty, unfortunately, but pressure them decently with Drover and Rampaging here. Should get through a little bit of damage. Hey, good stuff. Gonna want to close out things pretty quick because that crawling barons is maybe gonna grow out of control. Scoot swarm. Interesting. Well, rampaging scoot swarm. That should help us out in this matchup. Not really worried about him going off because it would just kill him. Quite all right by me. They have to kill Rampaging if they don't have an answer for it. Um, yeah, they're dead. Quite all right. Certainly going to bring in Anger of the Gods for game two. Yeah, that's working out. So maybe it's like a Golgari... Oh, Salti Mutate. Possibly. 
Hmm. Ooh, another marauding. Well, might as well go with the stomping ground. We'll go the second marauding. Galta for two. See if that does it. Maybe they have a counter, possibly, for two. Paradise Druid and the island. Um, hmm. All right. I don't know if this will just do it here. Maybe they were saving for something bigger, like Galta, possibly. Okay, still no answer. We're certainly not attacking with Rampage and Ferocidon. I'm pretty sure they would use the Insect and Paradise Druid to make three and be able to take out Rampaging. Right. Hey, if they want to keep playing lands, keep killing themselves, I don't think they're getting through this. I mean, we got Galta. So if they weren't being chipped away by Rampaging Frostodon, I'm pretty sure that might do it. Apennis, Apennis, however you pronounce that. Hopefully I'm pronouncing that right. How's it going? Having a nice Saturday afternoon live stream. Pretty good chance here. Game one, taking them down. I think we definitely got this locked up. It's going good. All right, I say we just um, probably just swing. Let's be conservative on the off chance they have something. If they can't deal with Galta, that should definitely be it, I would imagine. How's it going? Perfect. All right. So we got it. Anger of the Gods definitely coming in. Could probably drop Pyre of Heroes, actually. That's, um, Anger's going to be more, much more important than Pyre of Heroes. Hmm. Let's see. Hmm. Kind of like the fighting with Inscription of Abundance, but I think that should be good, as is. Get anger of the gods. Yeah. Hmm. Ooh, we did get anger, but no, not two sources of red. We do have it with Drover. Hopefully. Yeah. Probably not need to play anger turn three. We'll see if they really go off big time. Yeah, let's get that turn one commune out of the way. Searching, uh, yeah, probably should just be a land. Nice rockfall veil. A little bit of acceleration here, but we'll still go Drover and rip jaw next turn. So whenever we do go anger, we get that card draw, sweep them. I would imagine we'd be able to sweep them. Hopefully they don't get that Boneyard Lurker on the Grazer or anything, just so then it's out of range being at Fort Toughness, unfortunately. We'll see if they brought in any sort of counters. 
Okay, so nothing for creatures, but they might have something for the sweeper. See how tapped out they are. We might just go Anger of the Gods uh, turn coming up here, this next turn. Prismatic Bridge, very interesting. Uh, so, I say we just go Hunt Master, Stomping Ground, and pressure him that way. Get a Hasty Carnage Tyrant next turn. Alright, nice taking out the Grazer. Maybe this will be enough. Ooh, the Boneyard Lurker, yikes. Maybe Inscription of Abundance would have been nice being able to fight that guy. Alright, all right, not the end of the world. We got the Hasty Carnage next turn. See if... Well, I was thinking they might swing with the Boneyard Lurker, but no. I think the Carnage Tyrant might be enough. Maybe should bring in Mass Vandal to take out uh, Prismatic Bridge there. That'd be pretty good. Oh boy, they just keep mutating. This is... Well, it's not too bad. They're all tapped out except for Paradise Druid, which I'm not too worried about. I think maybe we'll swing possibly with everything, see how they block, and then use Anger of the Gods afterwards to hopefully take out Boneyard Lurker that did block probably Drover or Huntmaster. It doesn't really matter which one they block. Of course, going Carnage Tyrant is nice. I say we just go Carnage Tyrant, give it haste, get her done. I'd expect Boneyard Blur Blurker, Lurker, yes, to block Drover the Mighty. And I think that should be enough. Certainly next turn, go Anger of the Gods. Ooh, the Dirge Bat. Yikes. Won't be too bad if they can't mutate something, but this is four color... Oh, five color mutate. We're gonna have to watch out. Interesting. Well, wow. so an anger would definitely, possibly, help us get to win. Let's just go, Regisaur. Let's keep slamming the dinos. We'll get her done. Hopefully it's not the uh, octopus, I think it is. Oh, yeah, they can make a pretty big crawling barons, actually, I think. Yeah, make it a 4-4, that is not good.
Oh, Galta for two. I think that's what we're going to do. Alrighty. Good stuff. Hopefully they don't have an answer for her. Yeah, that's going to be good. Yeah, still not the end of the world. Sacrifice a creature. We got creatures to sacrifice. Certainly not Galta. But they're going to have to do something quick. Something big. Certainly. Hunt Master seems like the appropriate target. The weakest thing we already have Regis or given whatever we draw haste, but may not need it, especially if we're going Anger of the Gods next turn. Hmm, very interesting. Well, we'll still go Rampaging for Asadon, just to perhaps certainly lock things in. And yeah, let's see. See if that does it. Could be a set of the wreckage, possibly. Hopefully not. What are they doing? They must have something or else they would have conceded by now, I would imagine. Hmm. Okay, we got her done. Good stuff, good stuff. I was a little worried they had something there at the end. All right, let's get her going. Keep the streak alive. Crack into diamond. Three more matches. Three more. Three more wins. Let's go. Pretty exciting stuff. Ooh. No, we're not playing. We're playing rank. That's what we're playing. Hopefully we can feature Pyre of Heroes at some point. Definitely think it has some pretty good potential. Um, don't really ever seen it being used by anybody, so I think we'll try and make it work, certainly. Uh, that's a little rough. I mean, we do have turn two Pyre, which certainly could be helpful. Yeah, I think we'll go for that. Sheltered Thicket, Rootbound Craig, turn two and Pyre of Heroes. Mountain, turn three. Commune to dig for, hopefully, Marauding Raptor. Ooh, thanks. Hopefully it's, well, could be elves or shamans, either way. I think this is maybe too slow of a start. Golgari elves, okay, well, it's, it's still elves. We got Anger of the Gods for game two, so might not be all bad. Hmm. Oh, Golgari sacrifice. Well, commune, get us something good. Mm, not quite. Rampaging it is. We got enough lands, I would imagine. Craig Crown, Rockfall, should be good. Hopefully, maybe a Ripjaw next turn. We go that instead of Rampaging for Asadon. But at the very least, it looks like we'll get to Regis or Alpha. Bolus is okay. 
Well, it's all downhill here. Mass Vandal will be nice taking out the Bolus's Citadel there. Another rampage. Hmm. Well, I certainly think rampaging is going down in some way or another. Priest of the Forgotten Gods. Uh, oh, Mayhem Devil. Yikes. quite all right. I think that'll probably do it. We'll see what we draw next turn. We'll give it one more turn. But that's probably it, unfortunately. Ouch. Well, let's get the Regisaur. We'll see what they do with that. Swing with the token. Certainly not using Mayhem Devil to block. That would be nice. <laughs> if we do get Galt to that, I mean, it could potentially be it. Oh boy. Yeah, that is, that is definitely not happening. Ouch. Priest of the Forgotten Gods sacrifice both shambling ghasts, geists. Yeah. Well, anger. Mass Vandal. Hmm. I think we'll keep Galta. Could be nice. Definitely, we are on the play, so there's pretty decent potential to get her. But we gotta make a little bit more room. Hmm. I say we just take out rampaging. Yeah. Carnage definitely is going to be pretty hard for him to deal with, although Priest of the Forgotten Gods could take it out if Carnage is the only creature we have. Hopefully Anger of the Gods will help us in that regard. Yeah, definitely. I'll keep that. No anger of the gods, unfortunately, but we got definitely uh, some nice plays, certainly. Drove of the mighty coming up here. Yeah, two communes. Wow, we certainly we'll dig for probably one marauding at the very least, and then the next uh, maybe ripjaw. Oh, okay, good. The ripjaw. Still go hunt master. Hopefully they don't kill it some of this stuff. Oh, and the marauding. Perfect. Exactly what I would have wanted to see. Will be nice. Rip drive if we can get a couple draws off it to help us dig closer to that anger of the gods. Okay, we didn't pass one up with that commune there, so it's looking looking up. Oh, and Regisaur. Wow. Okay, so you know what we're gonna do? Regisaur plus rip draw. I think that's pretty good. That might uh, just do it. Yeah, I really don't care who blocks what. If we can take out the Mayhem Devil, uh, yeah. Target pretty much priority one, I think. Yeah, good stuff, good stuff. Commune will give us uh, who knows what next turn something useful if we don't draw something useful. I wouldn't expect them to be able to sweep if they do an anger of the gods possibly rip jaw are still left with that. Hmm. I might not do it. Oh, yes, definitely another Ripjaw. That is 100% what we're doing. Oh, and a Carnage Tyrant. And we can... Okay. Yep. That's what we're playing.
Oh, okay. Well, they didn't see us having anger, so I think that's definitely going to work out in our favor. Probably want to drop Galta, unfortunately, to make room for the inscription. Take out some of the key targets if they get it. A priest of the Forgotten Gods, the Mayhem Devil, that sort of thing. We do unfortunately have Rampage and Ferocidon in, so there is the potential we don't gain that life if we do pay for five. But it's a, it's a small risk we take. Definitely a nice starting hand, turn two Marauding, turn three Drover for one, and the second Marauding. It's going to be pretty fantastic. And then Inscription at some point, potentially a good chance for Inscription at five. So we'll get the full benefit. Ooh, that Priest, we are definitely killing that. So we'll go with Drover, swing with the Marauding. I think they'll definitely let that through. And then we'll just fight the priest, cause... Yeah. We're not letting that go off. I think definitely the... Well, it's hard to say. For me, priest is kill on sight. Ooh, the binding. Not too bad, not too bad. So I'm away with Drover. Nice 3-3. Three, three. Pretty decent. Yeah, next turn if we get another inscription, that's going to be good. Especially taking out something like the Mayhem Devil. Hopefully no anger of the gods here. That would make us cry. Ooh, a fatal push. There it is. Oh, and the Regisaur Alpha. That's good. Very good. Looks like they could have something that could kill Drover, which I think... Or Regisaur. Hopefully not Regisaur. But we'll swing with both of them. Collected company, interesting. <laughs> well, it's not too bad. Not the end of the world. Hopefully they don't have more creatures. Probably have more creatures. They'll use Priest of the Forgotten Gods coming up this turn, I would imagine. Especially if they have another Woe Strider. Hmm. Too bad we got uh, two lands in hand, but I think there's a pretty good chance we draw something quite useful coming up. Maybe should have just kept Galta in, probably. Hmm. Ooh, commune, beautiful stuff, exactly, well, pretty much exactly what we'd want to see. Yeah, another Regisaur, I can handle that. Just keep swinging with those three threes, and uh, I think they'll run out of gas, hopefully. Oh, no, that's not good. We need that mass vandal. Ouch. Oh, anger of the gods. Our savior. The exact thing we wanted to see. Maybe should have just gone Anger. That would have got us the win, actually. Now that I think about it. Dang. Well, at the very least, we'll go Anger next turn. And hopefully that's enough to do it. Ooh, good, good, good. Mass Vandal. Get rid of that Bolus' Citadel. If we just swing here, 
Mm, nah. We'll wait and see if they play some stuff next turn. If they do something with Wo Strider. Oh, collected company. All right, all right. So anger might be pretty nice. They did only get the road. Oh, yeah, this is going to be good. I think that should hopefully do it. They'll only be left with one creature, and we have two creatures that have four power. Hmm. Hopefully they don't have Fatal Push in the hand. Wow, that was a thing of beauty, my goodness. We got her done exactly. Probably missed a window a couple turns back, but still, Anger of the Gods coming through for us. Coming through strong. Wow. And Mass Vandal definitely getting rid of that Bolas' Citadel. I think it definitely helped us secure the win there. Maybe didn't do a whole lot because they were so low, but you never know. I think it's a pretty good addition for sure. Oh, yeah, definitely. That's a no-brainer, I think. Turn to Marauding, Ripjaw, Rampaging. Oh, that's a lot of mulligans. What is this person on? That is the question. Three. Ah, maybe it's some shenanigans. Oh, Azorius. Auras, possibly. Hopefully not. Hopefully no portable hole here. Okay, good stuff, good stuff. Well, definitely attempting marauding, double marauding, and uh, rip drop. That's always lovely. Oh, another rip drop. Oh, and commune. I like the looks of that. So it looks like Azorius Spirits. But we're pretty far ahead with what we got right now. Bant Spirits, okay. Anger of the Gods gonna be nice. Have to watch out if they have too much, but... Hmm, let's see. Commune, I think, definitely to get our four... Oh, not a fourth land. That sucks. Hmm. Well, rampaging it is. Keep up the pressure. Oh, they want to really take out that Marauding Raptor. That's okay. Still get a 2-2 out of that. Hmm. Oh, there we go. All right, so we know what we need to bring in, certainly Shifting Ceratops, uh, Anger of the Gods. Inscription to fight some stuff. I don't think they'll have a whole lot of artifacts, enchantments. Probably can leave Mass Vandal in the sideboard, but yeah. Drop Pyre of Heroes. Um, oh, no. Probably not a good chance we'll get to Galta. Um, Carnage Tyrant. Could be good. Yeah, I say we just drop Rampaging and call her a day. Ripjaw with Anger and just the fact maybe their creatures won't be super big. 
the trades with Ripjaw and the spirits won't be very advantageous. And that is definitely a hand I like to keep. See if they stumble a little bit at the start, but does not look like it. Oh, hand shifting. Things are looking pretty good for us. If they don't interrupt uh, what we play, Huntmaster, Marauding, turn three, hasty shifting with the Huntmaster. Looking good, looking good indeed. Hmm, yeah. Next turn, Rockfall Veil. Ooh, they got Essence Scatter. Essence Capture. Hey, that's all right. I mean, they didn't have any creature to put those counters on, so not the end of the world. And we can still go, oh, that's not so bad. We can still go Marauding Raptor and Drover here, which is pretty decent. Next turn, probably shifting Ceratops with how many creatures are blue. Ooh. Yeah, I think we really want the hasty shifting. Ooh, that could get ugly. Hopefully they don't get another Empyrean Eagle. Still decent pressure being able to use Drover to really trip away. They're getting pretty low at seven, so if depends what we get. If we get another shifting, I think we're looking pretty good. Ooh, yikes. Wonder what they got. Hopefully we can Yeah, nothing. Well, that doesn't happen too often. At least I mean we didn't get a land. Hmm. I think Supreme would block, yeah, Drover. Take out the Skyclave, get the creature. And we just pray they don't have another Lord or else that's gonna be it, unfortunately. Yeah, cause as is, Yeah, we'll just attack with everything. They might have collected company. Rattle chains. Still not going to do anything since shifting can fly past them. Um, they're all blue, so. I think this person forgot how protection from blue works. Good stuff, all right. Taking down Bant Spirits in two. Wow. One more win from Diamond, crossing the fingers. Hmm. I think we'll just take out Pyre of Heroes. That's, I mean, it is a very, very small sample size, but it's just never done anything for us. And we'll add in, hmm, let's see, what might we want to add in? A little bit more interaction could be nice. The classic, awesome, Primal Might. Uh, Domri has been good. Yeah, you know what? Let's bring in Domri. Always nice protecting against... Uh, Possible counter spells, that sort of thing. Guess it doesn't really fire Dino anymore, but keep the name as is for now. Still think there's something there with Pyre of Heroes. Maybe Dinos aren't the right fit, the right tribal fit for them, but yeah. It's got some potential. It's too bad you can only activate it at 
sorcery speed. If you could activate it at instant speed, I think definitely then we'd be in business. Kind of risky. But we do have marauding, so we'll see. Hopefully it's no life gain. That would be rough. Ooh, hunt. All right. Now we're cooking. Yikes, I'm seeing Orzov colors. Clerics. It's clerics, is it? Or just Orzov. We'll see. Double Galta. So we'd hope for Ripjaw coming up. Oh, closing statement. That's pretty good. But, hey, that's all right. Huntmaster and Marauding still. Yeah, if we get Drover... Or Ripjaw. A lot of options. A lot of options. Oh, no. We're not blocking this for sure. Oh, Rampaging for Ocidon still gives us the Hasty Galta. Beautiful stuff. Beautiful stuff. I think we'll give Rampaging for Ocidon Haste. Actually, should have given Galta Haste. Ah, uh, what am I doing? That was a misclick. Hopefully they don't have something to kill Galta. That would suck. And it's nice having Rampaging out since they won't be gaining any life from the life loop there. Ooh, okay. Wondering if uh, we just play the second Galta. Nah, nah. Play the second one, so, I mean, it's kind of like Galta had Vigilance for that turn. Valkmira might not save you. Wait. Uh, Galta, three, so that's eight. They take four, two. Yeah, let's just attack with everything. Alrighty, we got her done. Now we know what they're all about, kind of. Orzov control, I think. Something like that. But they had some pretty durable creatures there. Domri might be nice fighting some of them. I don't think Anger of the Gods is going to do a whole lot for us here. Certainly not Shifting Ceratops. Mass Vandal, potentially. I think they'll bring in a whole bunch of removal for the creatures we have, or bring in more of their removal if they have it. Huntmaster, kind of nice. I think we'll drop that. Hmm... Yeah, that's looking pretty good. Maybe bring in Inscription, Game 3 if it goes to that. Tie that in with Domri, it's Ramp if we don't have a creature to play, but we can use that mana that he ramps with to play Inscription of Abundance for 5. I like the looks of that. Turn 2 Drover. Hmm, maybe Turn 1 Commune. Actually, no, let's just get the shelter ticket out of the way. Got to come into play tapped at some point, so might as well do that first. Hopefully they don't kill Drover. Ooh, they don't have anything at instant speed, so that's nice. Hmm, let's see. All right, Ripjaw. Hopefully we just our next turn. Hopefully that's enough. I guess, uh, yikes. Uh, immune. Search for something good. Something big. Yeah. I think another Ripjaw is going to be good.
Regisaur next turn, swing probably with everything, see how they block, maybe if they attack this turn, who they remove. But it's looking maybe Orzov, legendary humans, something like that. Kaya, what does she do again? Ghost form, uh, yep. Hey, well, pay that two life, get that Regisaur. We're gonna swing with a bunch of guys. Would be nice taking a General Kudro there. Uh, hopefully they don't have a board wipe. It is nice that Drover can't block. I mean, it is a 1-1, so not a whole lot of trouble, and it can't tap. Okay. Still looking pretty good for us. Hopefully they swing with something. Ooh, they did not. So, does another Regisaur do it? I think it may. Imagine the general's enforcer has to block. Yeah, to save him. So we'll take out that enforcer, which is nice. Oh, we did it. Into diamond. That was a wonderful, beautiful little streak there. Fantastic stuff. Whew. Pyre of Heroes, I mean, as you saw, didn't do anything for us, unfortunately, but... Yeah, I think it's always going to be on my radar, even if it's not doing a whole lot. Just the fact that dinosaurs is a tribal. All right, well, let's see if we can uh, keep the streak alive. Good stuff. Actually, maybe we'll change the name of Iron Dino. Hmm. Yeah, amazing Dino, because that was amazing. Nice little amazing streak there. Diamond one, maybe they're breaking into Mythic with this win, if they win. So, oh, Yorion, I don't like Yorion. Oh, we're going first, not fast enough. Ooh. Ah, uh, no, that's not going to do it. Oh, that's better. I think definitely it's got to be Commune and... Ugh. That's a very clunky hand, but... Uh, rampaging... Yeah. Could have been Rockfall Veil, but if we get... Oh, that's not. Okay. Yeah. Rockfall Veil, just because it's going to come into play untapped, we'll be able to go Huntmaster and Marauding here. And we draw the Rampaging, that's nice. Right, let's see who they kill. That is the question. Marauding. Ooh. Well, we still got Rampaging, good stuff, good stuff. Hopefully we get close to Galta there. Be pretty sweet being able to take him out with the Queen Dino. Boy, this is getting pretty tense. Gonna be mass vandal certainly against a deck like Yorion. Ouch, that sucked. Wrath of God, ow. Well, well, well. Hey, we gotta play. Hopefully no fatal push. Oh, 
Well, I think that's probably going to do it, unfortunately. Mune should get a something, but I, it's going to be rough coming back from this. See what, if anything, they do to Regisaur. Huh. I got Yorion next turn. Possibly. Yeah, I would, th I would think it's got to be Yorion because they've used that three times. Yeah. I don't think that's something we can come back from. Ouch. Right, Shifting Ceratops, they got a little bit of stuff in blue. Certainly. Mass Vandal. Yes, please. Inscription, uh, nothing really creature-wise. That's going to help us. Domri, kind of nice. But I think we can do away with that. And... Ripjaw. All right. Hopefully we can go a little bit faster than the previous game. Hey, we'll take it. We got the Mass Vandal to get rid of anything problematic. That Demonic Pact, Oath of Kaya, Turn to Hunt Master, probably... Hasty, Rampaging Ferocidon. See if they kill something, might go Mass Vandal. They do kill... Yeah, we gotta lock in two green. If they do kill Hunt Master, probably Mass Vandal. We could go Rampaging and Mass Vandal. Oh, they do. Well, Mass Vandal it is. Okie dokie. At least we don't have to worry about that Trial of Ambition. some more mass vandals. Hey, at least we got Rampage. But that's kind of rough. It'll be a long ways to Carnage Tyrant. Oh. Okay, well, let's see what we draw next turn, but I think if we don't, at the very least, draw another land, something we can play, that might do it. Oh. But hey, we're in diamond. So it's uh, good stuff. Good stuff. I really think they could rework the rank system so you can actually drop out of diamond, platinum, whatever. That would really... It'd be rougher. It'd be certainly much harder. But I think it would increase the quality overall when you get to whatever you're aiming for, diamond, platinum, mythic, just lose some of the motivation. Hmm. Well, let's try one more, at the very least, see how it does. Hopefully a little better than Yorion, but I think Mask Vandal definitely is a pretty key addition. Maybe adding in Thrashing Brontodon for some more artifact enchantment removal interaction. Oh, that's pretty fantastic. A lot better than the first game of the last match. I'm definitely keeping that. Turn to Marauding Drow. We got a lot of goodies coming up. Looks like Jun Sacrifice, though. Anger of the Gods going to be pretty key. Game two. Hmm. It was a close one. Almost went Rockfall Veil vale, thinking that was a rootbound Craig. Yikes, that would have been embarrassing. 
Oh boy, I think marauding might die here. Oh, the Mayhem Devil. Yes, we are taking you out big time. Uh, you know what? They don't have anything to sacrifice, so they can't kill Drover when it's at one or Rampage. So I think it's probably better just to go both of those guys, pressure them with Marauding, see if they sacrifice. Yes, I'm happy for that. Get rid of Mayhem Devil. They might have a second one, but we don't want any shenanigans going on with that guy. Hmm. Oh, we got Ripjaw. Next turn. Yes, we can potentially have Galta if Drover and Ripjaw survive. Cross the fingers for that. They're getting the cat, I think. Double witch's oven. That's not good. But we got Galta, so that might just do it. Oh, that does it. All right, we took a game from him without revealing anger of the gods. But definitely mass vandal coming in. Mm, we could probably drop, well, rampaging actually can be nice if they get the cat stuff online. Domri, nah, not doing as much for us. Our removal, interaction, anger of the gods. Four more. I think uh, Huntmaster, actually, just because, you know, they'll bring in maybe more fatal pushes. Pretty easy to kill Huntmaster with two activations from Mayhem Devil. Maybe Inscription could be good. Mm. Yeah, I think we'll keep it as is. Potentially bring in Inscription for Game 3 if things were really rough for us. If we really need to take out a Priest of the Forgotten Gods, the Mayhem Devils, that sort of thing. Uh, I think that's a, that's a keeper. We got a good chance of drawing a third land, be able to go... Anger of the Gods turn three if we really need to. Commune will get us our third land for sure, I would imagine. Hopefully we don't have to do that. Ravenous Squirrel. Gonna want to take out that guy. ASAP. Oh, there we go. Beautiful stuff. But we'll still go Commune. Hmm. I think it probably should be a land. Yeah. Right, hopefully the squirrel doesn't go above three. I think depending what they play, yeah. Oh, 100% anger of the gods coming up. Yeah, that's good, that's gonna slow him down. Yeah, stomping ground, rampaging. See if they kill it. Maybe they play an oven next turn. We'll be able to go mass vandal, exile rampaging. Then we can exile the oven. Kind of want to just go mass vandal just to get the total power of stuff just to help cast Galta at later turns. Eight, we got five, okay. We'll leave one mass vandal in hand just in case they play the trail of crumbs the oven. Hmm. Oh, Carnage Tyrant, beautiful stuff that is. Oh, it's wonderful, wonderful sight to see. I think that should lock in Galta coming up.
hopefully no extinction event. That would kind of suck, but we need witch's oven. Good stuff. So hopefully they kill something. Alrighty, let's just, uh, let's go Galta and see if that doesn't do it. We'll swing with everything, see how they block, see what they kill, and then follow up with the Mass Vandal. Get rid of the oven. Okay. Yeah, I think this is definitely a pretty good position. Now, if they want to do that, I mean, Carnage Tyrant does have Trample, so we're getting through the maximum damage, which that's fine by me. Yeah, I say we just get the Mass Vandal, get that Witch's Oven out of there. Ooh, Galta's gone, that's for sure. Bam, took him down, all right. We lost to Yorion, but we redeemed ourselves against the classic, fantastic Jund. Beautiful stuff, beautiful stuff. Mass Vandal, I am keeping you in, that's for sure. All right, what are we at here? Over an hour, okay, well, maybe, uh, can we open up some packs? Oh. Clicked arena twice. We don't want to open up two copies. Reconnect, yes. Are we still up? Okay, we're still up. Hmm, let's see. Let's try one more. One more amazing dino. Hopefully not Yorion. That is just... Uh, that's a headache, for sure. Cinder vines, possibly, we could bring in. Haven't used it a whole lot. It's helped us win a few times, way back, way back when, but... That could be good, potentially, if we get Marauding Raptor. We're risking it. Ooh, no Marauding Raptor. Let's grab the Carnage Tyrant, though. We got four land, so very good chance... We'll get to Carnage eventually. We didn't have to pass up any two drops. So we increased the, oh, another Carnage. Interesting. We increased the chances of getting to the Drover, Hunt Master, Marauding Raptor. Dug five closer. Ooh, yeah. Well, Commune should get us it. Not. Okay, unclaimed territory. If we were able to play a another land there, go rampaging for Ostadon, definitely, but as is, it's looking pretty good. Maybe this is, ooh, Grixis, Grixis control, possibly. Let's go with Drover. On the off chance that he survives, we'll be able to go Carnage Tyrant one turn earlier. Hopefully he survives and they save something for a bigger dino. I don't think so, though. Pillar of Flame. Shock. That's quite all right. Well, I think definitely Ripjaw Raptor. They do something that... Deals damage, we maybe block the Bone Crusher, get to that sixth land a little sooner. Yes, we are blocking 100%. Hopefully, this helps us get that sixth land. 
I'd imagine they double up um, some damage base removal, which will draw two cards. Oh, there it is. Wow. Yep, Chandra. Take out the Ripjaw, I imagine. Hey, that, that is pretty fantastic stuff. I like that. There we go. Carnage Tyrant. Bam. Then probably Huntmaster, Marauding, and Ripjaw, or just Galta next turn. But I imagine they would have some sort of answer for it. So they don't have an answer for Galta. They're all tapped out, pretty much. Tapped out enough. Yeah, I think just Rampaging. If we get a land, probably Huntmaster plus Carnage. Ooh. So we could go Huntmaster, Marauding, and Galta. Yes, that's what we're doing. Six. Okay. So they can tra possibly transform Nickel Bolas this turn if they get another land. I guess they could have done it if they did Chandra, gave himself two red, could have transformed him. Oh, they're gonna have to do something to Galta, that's for sure. Oh, there we go, taking down Grixis. Turn one, well, we certainly don't need to bring in Anchor of the Gods. Probably not Mass Vandal, but definitely Shifting Ceratops. Switch that up for Ripjaw. Keep in Domri, I imagine that's gonna be good if they bring in more counter spells, that sort of thing. I think Inscription would be nice. We'll take out Huntmaster just because they have that red removal, the stomp, maybe some more red removal that deals two damage. So Huntmaster really doesn't survive that often against a deck like this. Yeah, a single mass Vandal. Probably could have dropped Galta since we are on the draw. They've gotten a whole lot more removal. There's Likely a lower chance we get to her, but if we get her down, that's going to close out the game pretty quick. Ooh. Again, that is risky. I think we probably should mulligan. It'd be pretty greedy to keep it. Oh, boy. Yeah, we'll mulligan once. Oh, okay. Well, uh, it's a little better. Yeah, we'll send Galt to pack in. Turn one, root bound. Yeah. Hopefully we draw a forest uh, stomping ground here. Be able to go marauding. Ooh, shelter thicket. Well, that's okay. We still have a potentially pretty good turn three with marauding raptor and drover of the mighty. Hopefully no thought sees here. Oh, man, we're drawing good lands, good lands. We got the fourth one. Really good chance of getting Carnage Tyrant next turn. Carnage Tyrant shifting, we got options. We do, well, we still have options, still have options. It's not the end of the world. So they got the Sweltering Suns, probably four, maybe a mix of Sweltering Suns and Anger of the Gods. Ooh, Regis or Alpha. Well, at the very least, we've got Rampaging for Asadon. I think he's probably dead. We'll take out Chandra if we can. Ooh, uh, yep, I think Rampaging's dead. Ouch. Oh, and... We really needed that other land, being able to take out Chandra with the hasty token. Would have been nice. Oh, so maybe they have a third Sweltering Suns in hand. Or some sort of removal. They're really digging for something, though. I think they would have probably wanted to keep that Sweltering Suns.
Oh, still no lands. Ouch, that is rough. Well, that might do it. They got gold span, we got nothing. Yikes. Oh, more Chandra's. Wow. Okay, so I think that's going to do it if we don't draw a land next turn. I would imagine that does it. Oh, phew. Good stuff, good stuff. Now, question is, yes, we'll probably attack one of the Chandras. Which one? That is the question. I think uh, we definitely want to attack Defiant. Make sure that she can't do a minus three, take out the Regis or Alpha there. Hopefully we get to go the second Regis or Alpha. Hopefully that's enough. Possibly that is not enough, because that is dead. Ouch. Double gold span. Okay, so we'll aim to go as fast as possible. I think we just bring in the Hunt Master. There's a big chance he dies, but speed is the name of the game. Drop Rampaging. Bring in Ripjaw. Unlock the potential for a nice, nice hasty turn three with Ripjaw shifting. Also, Ripjaw is going to be nice because Chandra isn't going to want to deal four to that, likely. Unless they double it up, which again, we're going to be drawing two cards from that interaction. Cross our fingers we get a red source here. Ooh, boy, that is not good. It was a risky hand. It's not paying off. Oh, oh. That's painful. You take risks sometimes. Doesn't work out. Oh, that is also painful. Well, I don't think we're coming back from this. It would have been pretty nice start. But, uh, hey, we got the land. Not quite what you want, but... We're at two. Can we get to three? Yep, I expected whatever we play to be dead with, uh, certainly with four up there. Hey, more lands. We gotta, gotta pay it though. Get the hunt master. Marauding. Hope we can get something going, but ooh, yikes. That's rough. Ouch. Okay, we're getting something started. Uh yeah. Shifting. Just in case we can block Nicol Bolas, they get another land, though. They transform him. Oh, they transform him. Never mind, they didn't need to. Okie dokie. That's how it goes. Well, I think that's a pretty good place to end it. Hopefully you enjoyed if you're watching later on. Amazing dinos all the time. We're always having fun. There's always room for improvement. See you next time.